Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and I just wanted to give you guys an update today on my life and what's been going on with my, um, pretty much my whole life, how things are going, uh, my routines, relationship things, and also my update on my medications. So, to begin, yes, I've been clear from gabapentin for about six months now, no longer taking it. Um, I'm on an antidepressant now. Um, or I've not now, I've always been on an antidepressant for a while now. So I'm down to one medication, which is great. Um, I'm still in graduate school, finishing my PhD up and my life is going very smoothly right now. Like everything's going really well. Now that I got off the gabapentin, I can think more clearly. Like I remember things better and like, I feel less depressed. Honestly, I feel like my brain's just 100% sharper, not 100%, but like probably 60% sharper than it was. Like, I feel like I... My brain feels like really powerful right now. Maybe it was because it was kind of being diminished by the use of gabapentin. So I wasn't really sure what it could fully do. But yeah, my brain feels sharp. My exercise routine is very good. Still running every day, doing about five miles a day. Um, diet, I pretty much eat the same thing every day. I'm kind of like weird about that. I, I like to eat eggs and uh, biscuits or something like that in the morning. Maybe some bacon. And then I usually eat a sandwich for lunch and then sort of pasta for dinner. It's pretty, pretty regular. Um, so that's been good. And uh, I also have a girlfriend who I've had for a while now. She's been a big help in my life. Um, so basically what I'm trying to say here is that, and let me just say that I wouldn't have gotten a girlfriend or I wouldn't have been capable of being in a relationship had I not gotten away from some serious drug use. And I think that when you're in a state of chronic drug use, you're not really able to connect with someone, even though it might appear that you are like, you're not fully, I don't think available to connect with another person. So that is, I will say that my relationships with all people have gotten better since, especially even after, first of all, after getting off of all the drugs that I was doing previously when I had uh, some issues, but then getting off of the prescribed gabapentin even has, I think, allowed me to, uh, you know, feel at least more present in the world and in uh, relationships with other people. Other than that, yeah, things are going smoothly. I'm going to stick on the antidepressant until I finish up grad school. I think that has been a big help. And it's, it's really, for me, it's been great uh, from past drug use, the depression that that leaves, it can kind of be difficult for some people that have abused things like uh, stimulants to get their brain serotonin and dopamine backfiring. I think this is a good uh, thing to stick with for now until I'm able to uh, really get my career and everything going a little more smoothly. A couple things that I do also, I take vitamins every day, pretty obvious. And then I take uh, lion's mane mushroom, which I believe has really been a, a big help in sort of like getting my brain back where I feel like it should be or where it used to be before um, I went into drug use. And uh, if, you, if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask. Um, but the main point of this video was to update you and let you know that things are going very smoothly and to help maybe motivate you to get off of any kind of um, substance that you might be on because your brain can, is very powerful. It can do great things and you'll be amazed at how well you can perform and how much work you can do and how, quali how like, high quality work you could produce if your brain is not in some way altered. So I think that you should let that be a driving factor if you're trying to get off of something. Anyway, uh, I just wanted to step in and say hi. Uh, have a great day.